Freedom means nothing unless you ask a person, what do you mean by freedom? If a guy wants to have three wives, is that okay with you? He says, no. Then you don't believe in freedom. You believe in certain kind of behavior that's acceptable within your society. But the word freedom implies a lot of things. Your concept of freedom differs from mine, so we don't have words like freedom. We have a freedom to pursue certain direction and check them out for your own well-being and then share them with other people if you find that they're useful. But the word freedom is so difficult to wrestle with. Or individual rights. That's a very hard subject to deal with. If you marry a girl that's a five times a nighter and you're a once a month or sexually, you're going to have problems. She says, I'm right. He says, no, I'm right. You're both right. So you have to look for a girl that's a once a month or whatever you are. You can't say to her, you're wrong. You should be a five-time denier like me. We always superimpose our own values on other people. That's why freedom of choice is ridiculous. A freedom to act as an individual will not work. So words like that have to be thrown out or set aside. Words like good, bad, right, wrong, he's doing a good thing, that depends on your value system. But if you wish to reach other people, I think if you stay with scientific scales of performance, you're more apt to have relevance. Otherwise you're going to have just a collaboration of all kinds of opinions subject to interpretation.